This downtown New York City loft is super stylish. The Nest editors pulled together this chic look with just a few simple tricks. Here's how. Flowers can brighten bare space in a living room. For a floral look that's different than the norm, try lining them in a row. The key to keeping the design modern is to choose flowers that have clean lines. We selected purple aliums. The long stems and simple circles are very contemporary. A minimal vase is another way to create a current look. We love these small ceramic bud ones. Put your books to good use and use them as book ends. Small books are a great way to keep larger ones in place. Organize them by using repetition and you'll give a shelf an instant lift. We lined ours with books of the same edition, but you can also categorize by color. A clear coffee table brings new life to your living room. It can make your favorite rug really stand out. And a see-through surface makes a room seem bigger, so it's especially great for small spaces. We love these two glass nesting tables. You can create a fun display by pairing your coffee table books with related items. Get personal by incorporating your hobbies or love for travel. Here we put a kitschy Eiffel Tower with a French guidebook and place Jackie O style shades atop a book on the fabulous First Lady. To create a unique display, try using empty picture frames and unframed pictures. A mix of frames of different shapes and sizes creates a sculptural effect without making the shelf appear too cluttered. Add some color by incorporating a picture that you love. To accent the antique look, we propped a classic portrait behind the frames. Modern styles work well too, so pick whatever suits your style. In our message area, we used a chalkboard as a centerpiece. It's a great place to jot down notes and will eliminate lots of messy papers. Here we arranged colored trays around the board. Not only are they cute, they are also perfect for storing your mail, keys, and other miscellaneous items. Here, we went for a fun, informal feel in the dining room. To set the mood, we made a long table seem more intimate. You can do this by using a shortened runner that doesn't reach the end of the table. We made a centerpiece out of hurricane lanterns and wine glasses. Turned upside down, they become a candle holder. Pastel shades create a fresh feel, so we used light greens and baby blues for the place settings. Play around with textures. It's a great way to mix things up too. We combined fabric napkins with vinyl placemats. The combo is light and relaxed. Finally, make your guests feel special and use place cards, but get resourceful and make them with something you have around the house. We made ours with leftover paint chips. It's an affordable way to craft a trendy design. With an organized office like this one, you'll be sure to get inspired. First, make sure you're sitting pretty in a stylish chair. You can make an old one seem new by changing the cushion cover. Here, we chose a decorative turquoise and white pattern. Next, we added personal touches to the desk. Some tricks? Make his and her boxes to stash odds and ends. Turn your favorite mugs into pen jars. Make an inspiration board for any other home projects you're working on. Stash your postcards and everyday mail in an unexpected place. A vintage birdcage has a whimsical appeal. You can also clip items on a lampshade. A white one atop a hand-blown glass lamp gives the illusion of a bigger area. We concealed the shelves to mask clutter. A thin layer of an opaque fabric hides a messy workspace or books and looks good too. For more tips and tricks, log on to www.thenest.com.